things. Mm -hmm. How much do you appreciate that? Um, I mean, I'm still preparing like I always prepare. Um, still backing them up. Uh, if that's the plan, I'm, for me, I'm getting ready to, to do whatever they want me to do or whatever they need me to do. So the preparation stays the same um, regardless. And I'm excited to learn a lot from him. Obviously, he's a very, very great returner. Um, to pick his brain a little bit, I'm, I'm, looking towards, uh, I'm looking forward to that. How much of a benefit can it be for you to focus a little more on the offense if that's even going to be the case? Um, I mean, like I said, I've always prepared the same way. It's not like... Um, you know, it was I was doing two different things for preparation. I, my preparation stays the same. Um, you know, the as far as if it benefits me, um, I'm going to do the same thing I've been doing. Um, prepare, study, um, like I've been doing. Nothing's going to change. And um, yeah, that's that. What could, it, what could it mean to the offense to have a player of his versatility, his speed, that sort of thing? Kind of a dynamic playmaker. I mean, I seen him today take off a little bit. And I wasn't even, you know, I was, oh man, he's quick and fast. So um, I'm sure he's going to help. He's going to help a lot. He's going to bring a, um, a lot to, to the offense. He's going to bring a lot with his speed and quickness and his change in direction. That is insane. Like I said, so I'm doing a little bit today, and it was kind of mind blowing. So I'm excited to watch him more. How much can you learn as a punt returner? I know the, 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 the general fan probably looks at punt returning as catch ball and run. I know it's obviously a lot more involved. Oh, yeah. What are the kind of things you're trying to learn from him? Shoot, I mean, for me, uh, the way he, when he catches the ball, how he gets in and out of his break, um, how he tracks the ball, um, his first moves in and out, of, uh, in and out of his breaks. Is he looking to get vertical right away, or is he? Um, how is his approach? You know, when that ball touches his hands, um, just from start to finish, when that ball's kicked, um, what is he thinking? What's going through his head? Is he looking at anything as the ball's being kicked after he's tracking the ball? Just so a lot more to it than what people think, and it's a lot harder than what people think. So, uh, man, I'm just excited to, to learn from them. What does it do for a locker room? Obviously, you guys are in the midst of you know, a great season when they're adding at this point in the season, and, and obviously sending a message that you know this is a season that they want to win. I mean, like I said, I mean, when we're adding people here, it's a very welcoming environment, first of all. I mean, I'm, like I said, when I, when I first got here, man, everybody is like, it's a one big family in this locker room. So um, those guys will fit right in, and um, everybody's been introducing themselves, and some guys already know them, you know, from past teams or whatnot are playing against him. So it's, it's a great environment to be in, and I'm just excited for what's next. Thank you. Thank you.